Hello and welcome back to the game room. Today I'm going to record you a video showing my pickups from today really. This is the second time that I've recorded this. The first time that I recorded it I uploaded it and I wasn't terribly happy. Um, I've actually picked something up since then which has pretty much made my day and it's something that I've been looking for for forever. So to pick one up I'm over the moon and I'm going to show you what that is at the end. Okay. I'm going to get a few of the rubbish things out of the way first. First thing I grabbed was Tennis Masters. I got this, I think Thursday or Friday. I think I paid £1.50 for it. As you can see behind me, I'm trying to expand the DS collection. Second thing I got was at a car boot. I picked up Namco Museum Battle Collection for the PSP. I paid £3 for that. It's a compilation with a ton of really cool old Namco games. I'm doing another car boot in a couple of weeks time at the Scouts again. And um, I've been trying to pick up some trade bait here and there that I can take with me for that. Because I'm going to try and put that money that I get from the car, from that doing that car book a couple of weeks time towards getting Kirby for the Switch. I'm sorry if you can hear gameplay footage from downstairs. My wife is playing South Park, I think, at this moment in time. Stick of Truth, not Stick of Truth. Fractured Battle, I think she's playing. Okay, so I'm going to show a couple of things that I picked up over a couple of last couple of days to, for the car book. I picked up GTA 5, which is pretty cool. I picked that up for a pound coin. I still have never played that, but I would rather play it on the PS4. These are the other two I grabbed uh, for the original Xbox 3, for the Xbox 360, sorry. I grabbed Ghost Recon and I grabbed LA Noir. Everyone wanted those. Um, next thing I grabbed, I shouldn't have grabbed it. I grabbed it because I saw this and Anyway, you can guess what it is. Grab just a wee. Uh, paid five for it, which is about £4.99 more than I should have spent on it. But alas, I'm a sucker for wees and things. Came with the loose copy of Wii Sports. I shall just bundle that and put that straight to the car boot. Uh, I think that might be from that spare cable. Um, right, on to my best thing onto the gem that's the rubbish onto the gem right um about a couple of hours ago i saw an advert no it wasn't a couple of hours ago it was yesterday in fact i saw an advert on facebook and it was for an original crystal xbox um crystal xboxes are okay i'm not I'm not a massive xbox fan but the difference between this one is something i've wanted for a while it was it was modded and it's been modded with about 4,000 games across a whole series of emulators. I've plugged it in for about 15, 20 minutes and had a read through of some of the games and had a look at them. Um, it, everything from any arcade games all the way through to Dreamcast games, NES games, Game Boy Advance, Super Nintendo, Mega Drive down to Sega Saturn games, which I've never played anything really on a Sega Saturn, so the opportunity to play a Sega Saturn would be incredible. It's in really good condition. I got chatting to the guy that did it and um, got to put it on Facebook and he modded it himself. Seems to have modded it really, really well. Um, it came with three separate controllers. It came with this, which I think is a wireless controller for the actual thing itself. I'm not sure what on earth plugs into that. That goes into the system, but I've no idea what plugs into that. It comes with all the controllers, all the wires, all the cables, everything. Some I would move that. I'm going to set that up in probably. I've tried to do it in here, but that rubbish telly, which you can see just there, um, it doesn't really take much. Cable isn't really a great telly, and the AV cables on it oh, doesn't have a white AV cable. A Red AV cable I think I need in order to run it and I can't so I'm going to run it on a different telly probably in the bedroom I set it up with a whole bunch of emulators which would be amazing and I'm desperate to sort of play a bunch of them because I don't have a lot of money and I can't afford a lot of games um, and I don't care about buying, selling and making money I just want to be able to play them and this is a fantastic opportunity for me to be able to play a bunch of games that I would never ever normally be able to get my hands on without resorting to playing them on a PC which I'd rather not do. So this is brilliant. I'll over, over the moon with that. I uh, will kind of do some reviews on this in the coming days. But yeah, gem that. I'm really, really happy with that. I paid 30 for that, which is not a lot at all. 
original Crystal Xbox without the mod goes for 40. So you can't really complain at 30, I didn't think. So absolutely over the moon, I will give you some updates on some of the games that I play and do some reviews in the next couple of days. Thank you very much.